What's up guys? Um, today we're going to be installing um, Boost Auto Parts wireless charger for the 2003 to 06 Chevy Silverados or um, GMC Sierras. Um, so the wireless charging kit is really simple and easy to install. You just got your um, adapter harness to uh, split off from the cigarette lighter um, plug inside the console to get power to your wireless charger. Um, so it's pretty much plug and play. Uh, you gotta drill a few holes and put in these four screws to mount this down. And All right, then... so um, the first step is to take the screws out here. Um, there is eight of them, uh, just a Phillips head, you know, take it out with a screwdriver or a drill and um, then the, this top piece will pop off. All right, so I got all the screws out of here and it just comes right off of there. Um, it's pretty easy to do. All right, so um, I got the drill hole in the top part of the console here. Um, it doesn't have to be perfect, there's some wiggle room. Uh, just try to get as close to the center and um, you know, just come back with just a pad and uh, just shove your plug right through. And um, the next step, we're going to uh, screw it down. All right, so Boost Auto provides you with um, some self-tapping Phillips head screws to secure down the pad um, so it doesn't move anywhere. Uh, you don't want to put them down too tight. You want them to be tight, but you don't want to strip out the plastic, so just go slow, use a screwdriver. Um, and then... We'll get this mounted back on to the console and then do the rest of the steps for the install. All right, so now that um, we got our pad mounted down, we're gonna put the rubber piece back on. And uh, there's just four little pegs in each corner that you gotta line up. And then it's back on there. Um, now we can reinstall this piece and uh, move on to the next step. All right, so your next step is going to be um, coming back here and uh, popping out this uh, radio control for the back seats. Um, so you just get a pry tool and then just pry on it and it comes right out. It's pretty easy. Um, then you can look down in here and there's your uh, cigarette lighter port and you're going to unplug that plug and... Uh, put your adapter harness in all right so um it's pretty easy to unplug all you have to do is push uh this piece right here down and uh it pulls right out of there and then you're gonna take um the black piece right here on your harness from boost auto parts and uh plug it together Got that plugged in um you're gonna take the splitter part where it splits off and plug it back into your cigarette lighter port. All right, so we got everything plugged in back here. Um, next, you're just gonna tuck all this um, excess wire down into the console and uh, we're gonna have to drill another hole. All right, so the next step here, um, you're gonna drill a hole right in here and um, another hole right about here to feed your wires through um you know same size drill bit as we did for the top piece of the center console um so i'm going to do that here all right, right now. so um we got our hole drilled back in here and uh right there to feed the wire through um the next step is you're going to be taking out the screws that hold this uh bucket in you got a few around here and then these four down here uh, then this should pop out and then we can get our wire fed through our hole right here. All right, so I got all the screws out and uh, this just pops up like that. Uh, you don't have to take it completely out. You just got to get it up enough out of the way so you can run your wire um, up into here. All right, so uh, we got the wire fed through. Um, you just want to leave some slack on it so it has some room to uh, move when you open and close it. And uh, just make sure you got enough pulled through here to uh, plug in down here on the top part of your center console. So when you're feeding it through, um, you just want to come up here up to this corner. Um, 
put the wire through and then you should be able to uh, find your hole right there. Um, you know, and then just put this all back in here and then uh, we can start reassembling. All right, so, you know, I just wanted to get all your screws back in. Just be careful, uh, don't strip out any plastic. Um, so now, you know, you got your power to here and uh, your indicator lights to tell you what's going on with your wireless charger. And I'll explain those here in a second. All right, guys, so um, I got it all installed here. Um, I got a phone here the, for demonstration, but just place it in the border here and um, it'll turn blue when it starts charging. And then um, when the phone's off, it'll go red. Um, so what I was talking about is um, this black button right here between the two lights. Um, you can use that to change between modes. Um, in the written instructions, it can, it'll tell you uh, everything about that button and what it does. Um, but yeah, this is definitely a great upgrade for these older trucks to uh, make them more modern. And this definitely looks a lot better than the old pad in here. All right, guys, so the, that's the installation on um, this wireless charger from Boost Auto Parts. Um, again, it works on 03 to 06 Chevy Silverados, GMC Sierras, or the Suburbans. As long as you got that center console, um, it'll work with that. I'll leave a link to Boost Auto's installation instructions and their video on, on how to install it as well as a uh, product link so you can easily find this if you want to get it for your truck. Um, I definitely think it's a great upgrade and uh, it looks a heck of a lot better. So definitely check out Boost Auto Parts and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.